Hello everyone. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Aisha Hanif. I hope that all of you are fine. So today the topic of discussion is forensic science and its scope. So let's get straight into the topic. Forensic science. So before knowing the scope of forensic science in various disciplines, we should know that what forensic science is. The word forensic is derived from the Latin forensis, meaning from a forum, a public place. Basically, the forensic science is a study of objects that are related to a crime. यहाँ पे जो ऑब्जेक्ट्स हैं वो एविडेंसेस हैं और इन्हीं एविडेंसेस को फर्दर फोरेंसिक साइंटिस्ट एनालाइज करते हैं देन दे ऑब्जर्व क्लासिफाई एंड इंटरप्रेट द डाटा इट इज़ द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ साइंस टू दोज क्रिमिनल एंड सिविल लॉज दैट आर इन्फोर्स बाय पुलिस एजेंसीज इन अ क्रिमिनल जस्टिस सिस्टम नाउ देर आर वेरियस डिसिप्लिन इन वेयर द फोरेंसिक साइंस इज अप्लाइड दीज आर फोरेंसिक ऑडेंटोलॉजी forensic biology forensic anthropology forensic toxicology forensic pathology trace evidence impression and pattern evidence and the last one is the ballistics now we will discuss each of these one by one the first one is the forensic odontology as the name indicates forensic odontology primarily involves the identification of the offender by comparing the dental records to a bite mark left on the victim isme hum log offender ka pata laga sakte hain through the dental records ya to jo se bhi bite mark left hai victim ki body ke upar as you can see in the first picture that by comparing the dental record we can identify a person which has committed the crime and in the second picture as there is a bite mark so through the bite mark we can also identify a person who has committed the crime forensic odontology helps in the identification of victims this is achieved through an examination of their teeth is pe proper examination hoti hai teeth ki the alignment and the overall structure of the mouth next one we have is the forensic biology फोरेंसिक बायोलॉजी बेसिकली एप्लीकेशन है बायोलॉजी की जिसमें हम लोग एसोसिएट करते हैं पर्सन को वेदर द सस्पेक्ट और अ विक्टम टू अ लोकेशन मोस्ट कॉमनली जो कि बायोलॉजिकल एविडेंस यूज होते हैं वो है ब्लड स्लाइवा सीमन स्किन यूरिन एंड हेयर फॉर एग्जाम्पल हेयर कैन ईजिली बी ट्रांसफर्ड फ्राम द सस्पेक्ट और द सस्पेक्ट क्लॉथ टू द विक्टम जो हेयर्स हैं वो इजीली ट्रांसफर हो सकते हैं या तो सस्पेक्ट से विक्टम के कपड़ों पर या तो विक्टम से सस्पेक्ट के कपड़ों पर ड्यूरिंग द क्राइम एंड इफ द हेयर इज इंटैक्ट विद द रूट सेल देन वी कैन इजीली परफॉर्म द डीएनए एनालिसिस एंड कैन आइडेंटिफाई अ पर्सन व्हिच हैज कमिट द क्राइम डीएनए बीइंग एस यूनिक टू एन इंडिविजुअल एस फिंगरप्रिंट हेल्प फोरेंसिक प्रोफेशनल्स आइडेंटिफाई और कन्फर्म एन अनआइडेंटिफाइड पर्सन और टू एलिमिनेट द सस्पेक्ट फ्राम अ लिस्ट ऑफ एक्यूज is uh, now we have forensic anthropology forensic anthropologists are experts in analyzing the human remains jo forensic anthropologists hote hain we human remains ko analyze karte hain because in some situation the body is in unrecognizable state so the forensic anthropologist can look at human remains and determine how the person died they also help to recover evidences at the crime scene using human bones the forensic anthropologist can determine the age of the individual the gender whether the male or the female and the height so for example if the skull is found at the crime scene then they can tell whether the skull is of the male and the female as female skull is smoother than males the male lower jaw is square with about 90 angle and male have high square chin On the other side, the female's lower jaw is sloped with an angle greater than 90, and females usually have rounded or more V-shaped chin. So, forensic anthropologists also help establish the time since death by identifying and examining injuries, if any. Or, वो बताते हैं कि death का time क्या था by identifying and examining the injuries अगर कोई सी भी हैं. The forensic toxicology. Forensic toxicologist involves analysis of biological samples to check for the presence of toxins and drugs. Is which a forensic toxicologist होते हैं वो biological samples को देखते हैं which may include the blood or saliva और उसमें वो देखते हैं कि toxin या drug की कितनी amount present थी. This branch of forensic science is of prime importance in road accidents poisoning. For example, if a person is driving a car and accident occurs, then the forensic toxicologist can determine that whether the accident is due to some intake of alcohol or some other reason is involved behind the accident. 
It also determines whether the quantity of substance are normal as per therapeutic dosage or exceed the permissible level. In this case, we see that the amount of the normal was given or the normal was given. It is utilized when the harmful agents we ingest. The forensic pathology. Forensic pathology is the pathology that focuses on determining the cause of death by examining a corpse. इसमें जो forensic pathologist होते हैं वो वजह बताते हैं कि death की वजह क्या थी by examining a corpse मतलब के death body. For example, वो wounds pattern को देखते हैं. It may be the knife या फिर gun कि कौन सा जख्म को देखे फिर वो पता लगाते हैं कि कौन सा weapon इस्तेमाल किया गया था. A forensic pathologist can therefore draw crucial inference on the surroundings, the cause of death which includes the following. The number one is the homicide. Homicide ka matlab hai ki ek insaan ka dousre insaan katal kare. The second one is the accidental, the death which caused during accident. The third one is natural, the death which occur naturally due to some a serious cause it may be a heart attack and a suicide if the person is just forced to commit the suicide the forensic pathologist examined the wound and injuries at autopsy at the scene of crime forensic pathologist hain wound or injury ko dekhte hain at autopsy autopsy ka matlab ye hai ke examine karte hain body ko during the post mortem aur isme wo wounds aur injuries ko dekhte hain is the trace evidence evidences such as fiber soil hair gun shoot residue are some of the example of trace evidence as it indicates trace evidence so they are in, uh, in a very minute quantity and as these are trace evidence so they can easily transfer between the objects people or the environment during a crime ye bahut hi kam quantity mein paaye jate hain to ye easily transfer ho sakte hain objects ke darmiyan people ya environment during a crime trace evidence also play an important role in establishing a prime link between a suspect and the victim For instance, a soil sample obtained from the shoe of a victim can give a critical clues on the location of the crime, and thus helps in tracing the sub suspect. For example, a suspect may pick up carpet fibers on his shoes or leave hairs behind at a crime scene. Hmm. Is the impression and pattern evidence? Impression evidence is the evidence created when two objects come in contact with inner force to create an impression. Impression evidence तब create होता है जब वो कोई से two objects strongly contact में आए और वो एक impression create करते हैं. For example, two dimensional impression है जैसे कि fingerprint. Pattern evidence analysis involves identification and analysis of additional information within an impression. Impression and pattern evidence, when used in conjunction, can help establish vital link between a suspect tool to a crime scene. For example, अगर के वेपन इस्तेमाल किया है गन और उसके ऊपर अगर फिंगरप्रिंट है तो वो एक इम्प्रेशन के तौर पे फिंगरप्रिंट आया है तो उसके जरिए फिर पता लगा सकते हैं कि कौन सा पर्सन था जिसने कमिट किया है क्राइम. Last one is the ballistic. Ballistic is a specialized forensic science that deals with the motion behavior such as bullets, rockets, bombs. The use of ballistics in forensic is mainly in the criminal investigation. You mainly criminal investigation we use with them. For instance, अगर एक bullet है crime scene पे मिली है तो उस bullet को देखे पता लगा सकते हैं कि कौन सी type of gun इस्तेमाल की गई थी और जब वो gun थी क्या उसका past भी किसी भी और other crime से associate थी कि नहीं और अगर तो bullet ने किसी hard surface को hit किया है then we can determine approximately Approximately where the shooter was standing, what angle the gun was fired from, and when the gun was fired. In fact, ballistic details are documented in a large database that is accessible by the law enforcement agencies. Understand this video. Thank you for watching. Allah Hafiz.